Residents of December and Guns, neighborhoods age like neighbors, shadows peel from corners, King Drive is the epicenter of an epidemic. Funerals fill lungs. Kingdoms live in a time capsule of 1951. Uh, what's good? My name is Malcolm London from Chicago. Uh, poet, performer, rapper, educator, uh, activist. Uh, here with Revolt TV, remembering Dr. King. Um, there's no question, you know, why there's so many streets in this country named after Dr. Martin Luther King. Um, you know, what he did and who he was was, you know, incredible. Uh, to have not only just to be a historical figure and, and to wield so much power with like churches and communities behind you, but like also the resilience that it took to have a strategy of nonviolence in a, in a very violent time. Um, that's something that I respect as an organizer, you know what I'm saying, as a younger cat who's out here and every day we have to listen to and pay attention to names that are that are cremated into hashtags. It's hard not to be, you know, upset uh, and, and want to, you know, be hurt, you know. Um, and so I think I think that's a that's a really amazing thing, you know what I'm saying, for, to be nonviolent. It's not even really just like to uh, remember like this man, but to really remember what the time period and, 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 the, and the symbol of coming together, that's what it is for me. What does it mean for us to, to, to love one another? You know what I'm saying? What does it look like? What does justice look like if not love in public? You know what I mean? Like, and, that, and we're wrestling with that in 1968, we're wrestling with it in 2016. You know, it feels like we're, you know, the 60s was a long time ago, but, but it's not. And so, you know, on this day, we, we should remember, you know, that legacy and, and figure out how we can build upon it and understand that we stand on those shoulders of, of folks like King and, and folks like that. We can't change what we need to be by remaining what we are. King Legacy tells us it is our duty to fight for our freedom. It's no more optional than breathing.